most people start learning to code by picking a programming language. Python, JavaScript, C++. Yeah, you need it to write code. But what really makes someone a highly skilled programmer isn't how well they know syntax. It's how well they think about problems and anticipate the system. And that's a skill most tutorials never teach. Let me show you what I mean. A while back, I was building a small app that needed to track user actions and show patterns over time. Sounds simple, right? At first, I jumped straight into code. Opened VS Code, wrote functions, tried loops. Ten minutes later, I was stuck. My logic was scattered. My output didn't make sense. And I remember thinking, I know JavaScript. So why can't I solve this? Then it hit me. I was coding too soon. I wasn't thinking about the problem. I was just typing syntax. So I stepped back and wrote the problem out in plain English. I need to track how users interact with my app, count each action, and detect the most common patterns. Then I asked myself, how would I do this if I had no code at all? I realized I'd start by breaking the system into states. What's possible right now? What changes the state? What needs to remain consistent no matter what? Once I had that clear, the coding felt different. I wasn't guessing anymore. I wasn't frustrated. I was building. Each step became a tiny puzzle I could solve logically. And here's the thing. Once I started thinking this way, I couldn't stop coding. Every new feature felt like a game. Every edge case was a challenge I wanted to beat. The same app that frustrated me before suddenly became addictive. Why? Because my brain was rewarded for each clear insight, each predictable result, each small victory. The problem wasn't the code, the problem was thinking blindly. Once I started seeing the system clearly, coding turned into a flow state. Hours would pass, and I barely noticed because every line of code now had a purpose, every bug was a puzzle, every fix was a win. That one realization changed everything. High-level programmers don't just write code, they design systems in their head first, then translate it to code. That clarity, that predictability, that sense of building something that actually works. It's addictive. So yeah, learning syntax is great. But if you really want coding to feel fun, to feel like a game you can't stop playing, start with how you think, not with how you type. Break problems into states, trace your assumptions, and watch your flow build naturally. Because once coding clicks this way, you don't just want to code, you need to code. And that's how coding becomes addictive. If you want to see exactly how to turn any coding challenge into a flow you can't stop, watch my next video. It'll show you the step-by-step -step method to make every coding session rewarding, predictable, and yes, addictive.